Welcome, children. My name is Timothy, and I am here to welcome, welcome, welcome you. We have a great uh, show lined up for you today. We're going to sing. We're going to pray. We're going to have a lesson. And are you ready? Here we go. can be found in Hebrews 13th chapter and the 6th verse. And this is the out of the International Children's Bible. So we can feel sure and say, I will not be afraid because the Lord is my helper. Helper. The Lord is my helper. Praise God. So we're going to pray. Ephesians 6 1 says, Children, obey your parents in God, for it is the right thing to do. We want to pray that in Jesus' name. Be safe. Praise his name. God is good. Amen. Amen. Now I want to introduce the one who's going to be bringing a lesson today. It is. Children's version of Acts 15. 
Acts 15, 36 to 41, and then we'll jump over and do Acts 16 and 9. Let's get ready. Paul started, Paul said to Barnabas, we should go back and visit the towns where the people believe in Jesus and see how they're doing. We always want to see how our brothers and sisters in Christ are doing, even if it's by phone, writing a letter, anything to make sure that we're all okay. Well, Barnabas wanted to take John, another missionary site, also called Mark, with them. Well, Paul didn't think it was wise. Why not? Because he didn't, because because John didn't continue on the journey with him, he went back. Oh. He didn't complete God's work with them, but it doesn't mean, boys and girls, that he didn't complete the work. Remember, if God has a journey for us, we need to finish his work first. Thank you, Jesus. So Paul and Barnabas had a big disagreement. A big disagreement about what had happened. What had happened? Just because you have a disagreement because Paul wanted to continue on, but Barnabas wanted to take uh, John Mark. So they didn't agree on that. Just because we're, we're Christians, sisters and brothers in Christ, sometimes we have disagreements, but God tells us to do it in love. So, God had another plan. Thank you, thank you, Lord. He always has a plan. So, Paul chose Silas and left. Now, ask your parents, boys and girls, to continue the story about God spoke to Paul because there's a whole lot of adventure going in there. You said a lot of things? Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. He did. He did. Wow. Timothy. But everyone God puts in their in their place. So Paul was chosen by the Antioch to do God's will, and they put him in, in the Lord's care. Yes. So whenever we're in God's care, we can't go wrong, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Chapter 69 says that night Paul went to sleep. And a vision came to him. That's a dream, my little brothers and sisters in Christ. Paul was told to go to a new place. A new place. A new place. Macedonia. Yes, wherever God tells us to go, let's be obedient and do his will. Yes. And tell other people about Jesus. Yes. Tell them. You know, my brothers and sisters in Christ, it is such a blessing when you can show God's love and tell others, your brothers and sisters, your family, your friends about Jesus Christ. Do you know what? What? Community Baptist wants you to know that Jesus saves and he loves you and he loves me and he loves Timothy. So please watch us on Facebook Live or YouTube and just get a blessed, blessed treat continuing on. We'll see you next time. Stay safe. God bless you. Bye. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus.